okay, one of the worst hurricanes is coming my way. It's gonna hit my city. It's gonna hit Corpus Christi. It's coming. I already feel sprinkles. So I just wanted to skate one last time. And that's what this is. Okay, so the sadness of my case falling apart. It broke into pieces. I wasn't able to film. So this is three days later after the hurricane. And you can see my neighbors and I had my house boarded up too. We all boarded up our windows. Most of us did. Some of us, some of the neighbors didn't. But yeah, it, it kind of rained off and on, but not as heavy as it did like in Houston. Here you can see a lot of uh, trees. The branches just fell off of that one tree from my neighbor's house. And the field is, is pretty much flooded a little bit. Not as I've seen worse. It's flooded a lot worse than that. So we didn't get as much rain as, as I thought we were going to get. Now I had to turn the audio off on most of this video. The background audio because it was just too windy and I was wearing a hat. I was wearing a cap and I had to take it off because I didn't want to lose it. It was just way too windy. The winds kind of lasted a few days after the initial hit. And even though it hit us like 50 miles away or so, we still got a lot of winds. And it was hard to see. Uh, I wasn't holding the camera right. You can't really see all the tree limbs beyond in the park, but you can kind of see some of them that fell off the trees. There was one tree that like snapped in half, but I didn't get that far. I didn't even know that that had happened because I didn't go past that way. But towards the end of the park, like way, way on the other side, a tree like split halfway and fell down. And that would have been cool too to pass by. I was real gloomy when I filmed this too. It wasn't any sun for a while. The sun was, it was really cloudy for a couple days and the sun didn't come out until like maybe day five. And then it got really hot. But we had like a really weird cool front come in, which is uncommon for, for August but it only lasted a day, like a night. And all the people that didn't have electricity, it's crazy, half of that neighborhood, like every other street, didn't have electricity. We lost it Friday night, and most of them didn't even get it back until six days later. It was like really miserable conditions. Yeah, this fence that covers the uh, dumpster broke sideways and was slanted. I always kind of skate this area. It's like my favorite spot to go to because it's so nearby. But yeah, this is all the tree stuff that fell from their tree that they have inside that one little spot. And there was a lot more tree damage on the other side of the school, but I didn't go that way. Like here you can barely see it because I hardly show. You can't really see all the, the other damage happened on the other side. It was just mostly tree stuff. It wasn't like too too bad to skate through though, but you know, I wasn't I wasn't exploring as much as I wanted to. I just wanted to kind of stay nearby not venture too far out. We had a Burger King sign like smashed down in the parking lot of the restaurant and they just left it there. Like they didn't even, like I guess they couldn't pick it up and I don't know if it's still there. It's, there you can see that, that bin's kind of fallen. Yeah I wanted to kind of, I wanted to, <laughs> I wanted to skate past the Burger King sign. But I wasn't going to cross all the streets to get over there because most of the streetlights were not working. 
here you can see like a lot of damage happened inside their little courtyard, their little garden area. This is like the, the school behind that school. There's some tra fallen um, trees, little baby trees. And that was about the extent of the damage that happened in that area. It wasn't really all that bad. But we were super lucky that it, we didn't get the full hit of the storm. But yeah, that was pretty much just uh, a look of what, what happened nearby from where I was. But the winds were pretty strong. They said the winds were like 150 miles an hour or something like that. To me, I couldn't tell. I mean, I was inside. The windows were boarded. I really couldn't hear the wind that strong. It didn't seem that strong to me, but I kind of slept through it. <laughs> but yeah, this is, this is the flow. Thanks for watching.